the phone out of the Versus pocket. Versus this particular Kirby. Took the phone out of the pocket, leaned forward in the chair. Classic video gamer strats. Okay, so Velocity, again, very aggressive for Kirby. Not that he doesn't do, you know, your usual Kirby bread and butters. But he likes to approach. D-Boss, very patient. Definitely will just strangle you in the neutral with Falcon Superior movement. He's very quick, very, very good at spacing out his aerials to get things going early. Ooh. Yeah. So misses the jump there, so doesn't get to recover, but kind of a difficult recovery anyway, so shouldn't be too worried about it. Oh, great scoop up there. He just wa he waited for Velocity yeah. to do the jump, immediately dash into up air. That was so smart from D-Boss, and did it in a manner of frames that like was really hard for Velocity to hug, even react. Zero. Yeah. So I'm surprised Velocity wasn't able to get anything back on him because he was hugged at zero, but... Yeah, D-Boss played it pretty conservative, and like I think he did a good job of staying out of reach. And there you see again D-Boss playing conservatively, just not getting hit, following that Isaiah's advice. That won't quite kill. Good trade for D-Boss. Should be an easy edge guard. Okay. Oh, but the fear. Sometimes that's all Got it takes. Him a, yeah, a little bit with the fear. Uh, he did miss it, but he put on a lot of pressure for sure. Oh, that interesting use of the forward air there. Kill from that part of the stage. I like that forward air to try might. and continue the combo. Okay, yeah, no Go jumps. On, yeah, yeah. Oh, and jumps. D boss up three stocks. The hook is one. really strong against Kirby's recovery. It's actually not so simple to recover as Kirby in this matchup. Definitely not one of the easier parts for Kirby in this matchup. That should be it. Yeah. Okay. So this could still turn around pretty easily. Kirby definitely has the tools to gimp the crap out of Falcon and make it really hard for him. Yeah, but I, I think that this is less of a character matchup we've been seeing a payoff than a player matchup. I think that D-Boss okay. has just been doing a good job of staying out of reach and yeah, not I giving agree. Velocity the opportunities he wants. Yeah, I agree. This could be bad for D-Boss. Getting a couple things started. Ooh. Goes for the back air. I, I don't know if that was supposed to be an air, but he ends up finishing it up anyway. Yeah, D-Boss, still one opening, really, from taking this game if he gets a good forward throw, as an example. Oh, but oh that could be. tech chase. Uh, wow, he gets out of it. Sort of a weird tech chase from Velocity. He just sort of knew where he went and then put out another aerial. Fishing it out of the pond. Ooh. Yeah, Velocity Jones going for those uh, options through the stage. And again, showing a little patience. Just turning his butt to D-Boss, daring him to come up against the back or the up tilt. He already used a couple jumps. Okay, he does Very get back. Very good by Velocity Jones. He still doesn't quite have the initiative. Okay. Oh, yeah, Down there? Oh. No? Okay, the Nair is nice. Yeah, he has He's one more shot yeah. for Velocity Jones to yeah, screw yeah, up, yeah. but puts it away. Okay, you see Velocity Jones <laughs> leaning back in his chair, breathing a sigh of relief. His heart must be pounding. Yeah, well, he started off early. He was winning and then definitely losing, and then he brought it all the way back. So, you know, he's he's figuring it out. Yeah, Divos is smiling too. Everyone's having a good time here at Smash and Splash 5 in the Wisconsin Dells. So I predict from Divos more of the same. From Velocity Jones trying to keep things more like the the last sock than the middle two socks. D Boss, very nice. Ooh, great combo there from D Boss. Still has to edge guard. And Velocity Jones knows that he's looking for the hook. Ooh. Wow. <laughs> okay. Good tech um, to stay in it for a second, but yeah, no D-Boss is all over him. Turning it around. And again, he just dashes away. Dude, the scoop up airs are so good from D Boss. They're so fast. Velocity's not ready. You can tell that it's throwing Velocity off. I don't think he's seen that from the Falcons that we always play. Yeah, the D Boss is definitely fishing out a few more hits than you might expect given the matchup. So you might be right that that's an element of a, of a player experience. 
Yeah, that's straight shield battles there. Okay, that's a back throw. Yeah, weird sort of spacing, but I guess it worked out. Debuff's now up two stocks. Yeah, for the moment. There you go. Yeah, Velocity Jones is playing it clean. They must be, they're talking to each other in the middle of this set. They're having a great time. Yeah, okay. Have you ever seen somebody smile that hard while they're trying to DI? <laughs> okay, D Boss just backs off. Okay, or nice. he looks, nice it makes it look like yeah, it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, Velocity ran all the way in on him from across the stage, so, okay, I, right. I, There's the. I, I, I'd call that a bait, though. We got, okay, all right. Yeah, so D-Boss looking, looking good again, but... Oh, Velo so he goes for the up air there again. He's he's all about up air. Doesn't really want to start off with down air or anything. Up air. Oh, if you got that up air, he's going to go to down air. End it, but... Yeah, this is not over by any sort of the imagination. Mm -hmm. Yeah, velocity oh, so being slippity, close, slip, yeah. slippity, velocity, slippity. Wow. So just a couple, a couple more openings like that, and he could still close this set out here and now. And we see D Boss just playing his game, just trying to be in a threatening range. Okay, gets That's the a reverse. That's good starter for him. I think he's wise not to thre try to threaten harder there. Okay. This stock has gone on for a long time now. Yeah, Velocity Jones, and and he, that's what Velocity needs. He needs to be able just to... Ooh, killer finish there from Velocity. Gets the weak back air to down air. Like it's now last saying. stock. D-Boss could, could lose this. There's always been that possibility. And again, he has a good opener, but he still has to bring it home. And he, you really don't want to threaten when you have that. <gasps> oh, yeah, no. This should be it for, oh, no. he gets the tech. Yeah, good good DI from D-Boss to tech onto the platform at the right time. Otherwise, that was Curtin's that's going to be back should, here. All right. All right. Here we go. Here We're going we to go. get three. Yeah, he just, yeah, he, that was a very close game. Velocity going was doing exactly what he needed to. Simply of avoiding any clean hits and then capitalizing on the opportunities he got, but D-Boss running that same game plan. Yeah. Uh, yeah, we'll see how this goes. I mean, it's been a little back and forth. I, each game has been like, has started with Velocity winning and then gone back in D-Boss's favor, and then one of them ended with Velocity winning and one of them ended with D-Boss. So we'll really see how it comes out or plays out in this last game. A strong opening. We're getting really the close to, to the bracket here, more. so this matchup could be really relevant for making right. top 16. Yeah, he didn't go for the up B there. I was anticipating some love line stats. Ooh, yeah, the, the jump away right there. Divas, yeah, right choice, I think. Yeah, all right. That's going to be a first stock for D Boss, and a pretty nice one at that. He's only got two percent on. Little, uh, little two percent milk, blue bottle cap. Again, he's, he's not pushing it. He has the lead, but he wants to make sure oh, that he keeps it. I haven't seen a lot of down air out of D-Boss. Like, he hasn't wanted to just end stocks with up air to down air, but I, I guess up air is just his thing. He's really comfortable with the up B finish off that. Knows he can get his jump back, but... He's making it work. Ooh, the Nair will not quite kill, but interesting idea to just try and send Velocity as far as possible. Velocity running full speed right at Falcon across the stage. As fast as the little puffball can on his stubby little clown feet. I like never see Kirby run for that far. Yeah, great exhibition <gasps> of the range on Great up trade there, but yeah, up tilt's faster. Ooh. He's managed, managed to get all the way on stage, so he has a jump to work with here. Velocity's bringing this back, you know, you know, making sure he gets his Kirby on Falcon things. Yeah, I'd, I'd like to point out that this game is moving a lot more slowly than either of the previous two games have. We have only two stocks total gone at 90 seconds in. Yeah, the crowd's starting to get into this. Yeah, yeah. Michigan's crowd's... getting behind Velocity. Chicago's behind. I think D people are mostly done playing. Bracket might start soon. Everyone's kind of like congregating. Yeah, D boss not in the worst position, and no. that is very good for him. Oh my gosh! And he lived. He's living. 
Ooh. Both of these guys having a great time. Oh, okay. The, the, oh! The down tilt doesn't get him, but he's able to get the runoff down air. D-Boss. Taking a second. And I think like I think oh. D-Boss is, is maybe through to top 16, and Velocity would need to win this. So this is a big game, like. Oh, uh, yeah. Up tilts. Oh my yeah, gosh. He's, he's gotten a couple of really great openings. D-Boss hasn't found his footing in a long time now. There's a point when it was like both four stocks. Okay, here we go. All right. Yeah. There was a point where it was both three stocks and Velocity wow. was at a high percent, and he's taking two stocks. Inside. Michigan is popping off. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Michigan gets rowdy, so. Okay. Yeah. But Why Chicago's also off, here in force. I don't think they're popping off, though. <laughs> I'd be popping off, but I'm on the mic. Where's B-Side when you need him? B-Side could totally be as loud as all of Michigan combined on his own. There we go. He gets the hit. Oh, and the second the hit. The really late there. Oh, my gosh. Yes. Safe option from D-Boss, but. Terrible option from D-Boss. <laughs> <laughs> Another back air. Yeah, that D -boss one might. special. Oh my god. The, he goes for a different option that time. Playing with his food, Yo, the dude. Pivot oh my grab. god. What is happening? But he's at 105 okay. and Kirby has age limits ability. We got we got chance for Sam. But at this at this percent, the up tilt doesn't combo into anything. Does he have a jump? He does. Ooh, and last we're stock. at last stock game of yeah, stock of champions. Oh, bait that him. could be it. Velocity Zone's pushing. Oh, great. D-Boss gets back great to neutral. Great fastball to ledge. Great That's fastball to ledge needed. there. He needed to get escape that. This is still, this is one opening from D-Boss bringing this right back, but we'll have to see who, is it going to be an up tilt or a grab? Yeah, D-Boss has, I, I don't think we've seen, the like maybe even any KOs from D-Boss off of a single grab. So if, right, but he could get 40% easy. So I'm saying. Yeah, he, he could definitely force an edge guard situation. Yeah. And that oh. could be the opening he needs. Good DI from Velocity. Will Won't it do quite it? kill yet. yet. And he's going way high. Oh, but the hook! Gets the hook! Velocity. D-Boss takes it home. D-Boss able to just clutch it out right at the end. All three games went back and then forth and then back again to some sort of scuffle at the end.